What's happening? Ah! You killed him! What? Claire, what's going on? Huh? Your vitals are all over the place. You blood got to his death. What? What are you talking about? I don't understand. Don't play innocent. You killed him. No! Damn it. I can't disconnect. The resonance area warp is too big. Claire. Claire. Hang in there. Hey. Hey for what you did. No. No. Leave me alone. Is... is that... No, I can't. I won't drag you into this. Leave me. Get out of my mind! Claire is still in a coma. During the mission, her brain activity started spiking, and you went through a forced disconnect. I'm not sure, but Claire may have consciously pushed you out of the resonance area. But there's no sign that Claire herself disconnected. Her consciousness is still deep in the resonance area. That's my hypothesis, at least. I'm so sorry. I'm responsible for this. I knew Claire had doubts, but I sent her in anyway. <sighs> You're right. We need to figure out our next step. First, leaving Claire in this state is extremely dangerous. The thread connecting her mind and body is fraying, and if it snaps, she won't come back. If you can reconnect to Claire's resonance area, you might be able to guide her out. But her mind is barred right now, so we can't even do that. There is something, but it might be a stretch. I told you that resonance areas can be archived, right? We finally got done transcribing the data. It took a really long time, though. So if the archive works, we should be able to make a copy of Claire's resonance area. If you connect to that copy and are able to untangle the memory node inside, that might provide a clue on how to get through Claire's mental barrier. Got it. I'll do what I can on my end. I'll perform a final check on the archive status and prepare it for connection. Hey, we'll save Claire. I swear it.